For a lot of people, there's nothing more important in their lives than their families. Unfortunately for celebrities, this isn't the case as many have lived their lives and felt little to no connection to the people they share genes with. Hi, I'm Stacey Taylor and today I'm counting down the top 10 celebrities who hate their famous parents. So how do you feel about famous celebrities growing up in their parents' shadows? And let us know in the comments below. Coming in at number 10 today, we have Miley Cyrus, entering into the spotlight at a young age thanks to her role on the show Hannah Montana which co-starred her dad, Billy Ray Cyrus, who was a huge country star in the early 90s. At the time, the two shared a close bond. However, jump to today, and the two are no longer on speaking terms. A source would then spill to the son that Billy Ray's divorce to Miley's mom, Tish, had a massive impact on the wrecking ball hitmaker, who had unfollowed her dad on social media. While speaking about the ongoing feud, the source would then mention Miley is all about peace, but she didn't agree with some things that her father has done. It really escalated, and they are not not on good terms. Neither of them at this moment are particularly eager to make amends right now without an apology. Apparently their disagreement all started when Billy Ray Cyrus got engaged to his new girlfriend Fire Rose who he met on the set as one of the young actresses working on Hannah Montana with Miley. Number 9 Drew Barrymore Many people don't know that Drew Barrymore comes from a family full of actors, which starts with her great grandparents who were both stage actors and since has continued on as each generation of her family has had members that have gained some measures of success in the industry. For instance, Lionel Barrymore, who was born in 1978, was best known for playing Mr. Potter in It's a Wonderful Life. And Drew's mother, Jade, is not the most successful member of the clan, but she was acting in a large array of projects and earned herself some notary when Jade also did pose for Playboy. And she's mostly just famous because of Drew's successful acting career. Considering that Drew followed her into the industry, you may have forgotten at one point of their lives they seem to be pretty close, but that's actually not the case. As Drew is pretty much estranged from her mom, and she's even been quoted saying, can't really be in each other's lives. Being emancipated from her parents since the age of 14, Drew knew she had to get away from her mother at a young age because at the age of 9, her mother was making her adopt this party lifestyle while bringing her to Studio 54. While Drew was able to forgive her parents, she said that she will always always be there for her mom, but sometimes she realizes that their chemistry and behavior will drum up a feeling that makes her say that she needs a break again. Hey my little peaches, are you liking this video so far? If so, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Number 8, Kate Hudson. Back in 2021, Kate Hudson would open up about her complex family dynamic, including her estrangement from her father. In an interview with Today, the actress would speak about growing up distant from her dad, who is a musician and actor, Bill Hudson. In the interview, Kate would say, I think estrangement is unfortunately quite common. I think it's important for people to talk about that. If they can't reconnect or if it's too challenging, that's okay, right? I have a great family. I have a beautiful mother. I have a stepfather who stepped in and played a huge, huge part in sharing what it is to have a dependable father figure in our life. But it doesn't take away from the fact that we didn't know our dad. Even though Kate is estranged from her dad, she would know that she has gone through a process that made her look at her dad and realize that she does still have love for him and that the love will never go anywhere. However, her healing process has been pretty personal and she feels like sometimes people just want to hear that they're not alone in that. Number 7, Lindsay Lohan. Lindsay Lohan is one of those celebrities that was so big at one point in the industry that she actually was able to make her family become minor celebrities. But it's pretty sad to say that her parents owe their low level of fame due to their defunctional relationship with their daughter. Things between Lindsay Lohan and her mother Dina have been pretty difficult in the past with the actress and singer making several negative statements about her mother but it seems like it's really Lindsay's dad Michael that Lindsay has the most troubles with. As Lindsay has even revealed her distaste for her father by even going as far to record a song that highlighted her treatment from her father. And she has even once described her father Michael as being a lunatic. Just by judging their past history we can totally understand why Lindsay has chosen to live her life without her father's shadow as he has done some pretty outrageous things to her. For an example, do you remember when he once recorded a phone call she made to him when she felt like her mother was out of control and then he turned around and sold the private conversation to the media? If your parents saw you as a commodity to give them fame and money, you'd probably turn away from them as well too. Number 6, Brody Jenner. Now Brody Jenner is famous due to the accomplishment of people he is related to. That is actually a thing that is possible in modern society. Now if 
you don't know who Brody Jenner is, he is the son of athlete who competed as Bruce Jenner, who later married into the Kardashian family and then publicly transitioned into becoming the beautiful Caitlyn Jenner, and the stepson of Kris Jenner, the leader of the Kardashian media empire. While Brody was briefly featured on the reality TV series Keeping Up with the Kardashians at one time, things have since gotten a little less cordial. After she and Caitlyn had been separated, Brody has not kept his feelings towards his former stepmother or her children a secret. He even came for the Kardashian empire when he was quoted saying that the Kardashians are not his family, but more of a profanity laced manner at Coachella in 2016. In an earlier interview, he would also reveal that he had cut ties with Chris. Number five, Angelina Jolie. Arguably, at one point, Angelina was the biggest actress in the world, and she will always be remembered for her roles in films like. Tomb Raider, Mr. and Mrs. Smith, Maleficent, and many more. Being the daughter of John Voight, her dad was also one of the most famous actors in the world at one point due to his work in movies like Midnight Cowboy and Deliverance, and still gets regular acting work to this day. Running in a lot of the same circles, you would think that this quality may draw them closer to another, but it's far from that case. It appears that both actors have struggled to have a strong relationship since Angelina was eight years old. While it looks like they had moments of reconciliation, signs of severe rifts have surfaced. While John has pleaded with Angelina to get help in some public interviews, instead of listening to her dad, she's taken things to another level and completely erased him from her life. She even legally changed her name from Angelina Jolie Voint to Angelina Jolie to obviously make a jab at her father, which is actually pretty messed up. Number four, the Jacksons. There is no doubt that the Jackson family is one of the most celebrated families when it comes to the history of music. First coming into prominence, Due to the Jackson 5, they would gain huge success. Nobody could have ever expected the group would be that huge and overshadowed in the years to come. When Michael went out on his own as a solo star, he became one of the biggest celebrities alive and was nicknamed the King of Pop for good reasons. Not one to stay in the shadows, even his little sister Janet would follow her brothers into the music industry and outdid everyone other than Michael, whose career she arguably rivaled with at one time. Was so many superstars coming from one single family, it looks like they can owe a lot of their acclaimed fame to their father Joe, who from all the accounts pushed them hard to be as close as perfect as possible. Unfortunately, that came in the forms of physical altercations, which he admitted to in 2010, and because of that, he was seen by his kids and much of the public as a monster, especially when it came to his altercations with Michael Jackson. As a result, there have been reports that Michael couldn't forgive him, and Joe has largely been excommunicated from his large family. Number three, Anna Chickadee Cardwell. For those of you who aren't really fans of reality TV, then you may have no idea who Anna Chickadee Cardwell is. But for anyone who enjoys reality TV, then you most likely know who she is, thanks to the spin off of a highly controversial show called Toddlers in Tiaras. The show Here Comes Honey Boo Boo focused on a unique beauty pageant family that all go by interesting nicknames like Sugar Bear and Chubbs, and one of the daughters who went by Chickadee. And she's grown up and has her own family since the cancellation of the show that introduced her to the world. Her relationship with her mother has become strained, publicly claiming that Mama June, as she is known, misappropriated the funds she earned from appearing on the show. It's clear that Anna holds a lot of anger towards her mother. While June has continued to deny Anna's claims, she has stated that the money was sent directly to her daughter's bank account. And the distrust between them means that June is not allowed to have unsupervised contact contact with her granddaughter. And number two, we have Dimitri Bell. When Dimitri Bell first got drafted into the Buffalo Bills NFL team in 2008, Bell played well enough that he was able to continue to play for the Cowboys as late as 2013. Like all professionals, he has been the topic of a lot of discussions, but his career isn't the first reason he has been on the lips of people. That is because he is the son of 14 time NBA All-Star player Carl Malone, and his relationship with his dad has has never been anything close to controversial. The child of Gloria Bell, who was only 13 years old at the time of his birth, and his father, who was 20 the year he was born, spent years denying he fathered a child with a minor. When Bell finally learned
learned about his parentage and met his father after graduating from high school. He finally met his father and his father would tell him it was too late to have a father and son relationship. According to reports, Bella is said to be ashamed of the relationship he shares with his father, which is a strong indication that he has a lot of justified anger towards his father. Number 1. Francis Bean Cobain Being the child of Nirvana frontman Kurt Cobain and his wife Courtney Love who fronted the band whole, since Francis Bean Cobain was born, she was instantly put into a position that meant the world was likely to pay attention to her. And while it seemed like she should have had a life full of luxury and peace, it was actually far from that. When Francis's father took his own life when she was a child, Courtney would fall into perils of substance and addiction, and Francis's home life would become very difficult. Despite being a child of music icon, Francis doesn't see her father in the same light that much as the world sees her father in. Instead, Francis feels like Kurt abandoned her in the worst possible way, and she isn't exactly fond of her mom. When Frances was finally able to emancipate herself from her mother, Frances would break off nearly all contact she had with her mother for years, to the point that when Frances tweeted out to her mom in 2012, it was seen as a breakthrough between them. Well that's it for this video my little peaches, until the next one remember to stay juicy.